the fuck going on if you've been rocking with me shout out to you if you're new to the channel leave a like comment and a subscription so it's being said that bloodhound little jeff was just shot and killed in chicago for those who don't know who bloodhound little jeff is he's one of jb ben laden homies i know some of y'all probably seen a video of him snorting a perk on um DJU podcast when DJU was interviewing him, he was snoring a perk. Basically, he basically known for just doing all types of crazy ass shit. You feel me? Like he be on some crash out shit. Like before he got killed, like his name was ringing bells like a motherfucker. First off, I want to send my condolences and my prayers out to his family. Even though he was out here doing shit to potentially put him in this type of predicament, I still send my condolences and and. And prayers out to his loved ones because they loved him and that's his family and shit. And they going to feel how they feel about him and everybody else going to feel how they feel about him as well. It's a fucked up predicament, but at the same time, niggas got to know what type of shit they signed up for. And I'm pretty sure a lot of these street niggas know what come with this shit, bro. So when you niggas out here doing crash show shit and doing all this hot shit, bro, eventually that shit will catch up with you, believe it or not. Especially when you move moving cocky doing all this hot shit thinking somebody can't touch you that's gonna make niggas want to get up with you even more that's the type shit that's gonna actively make a motherfucker go out looking for you non-stop until they find your ass and the way he was moving the way he was carrying himself bro it was only a matter of time with that shit it was only a matter of time and summer ain't even got started yet bro so to all the niggas who want to crash out and do all this hot shit and just present yourself in that type of manner Bro, the energy you put out into the universe will come back to you, bro. It's gonna come back to you. Watch the type of shit you say. You have to watch the type of shit you do. You have to watch the company you keep because people can bring, they can transfer energy onto you. They can transfer bad energy onto you depending on who, what type of crowd you be with, what type of people you fuck with. Bad energy do travel from person to person. Overall, bro, niggas just gotta be more mindful. I ain't even gonna make too long. I can talk motherfuckers head off, man. I'm checking in and checking out gangs.